Hey guys, what's going on today? Welcome to another review vid for PMKF30. Sorry, it's been a while since I've done a review vid, and I know I've uh, posted, been posting a lot of MK11 gameplay videos lately. The game has just been pretty addicting, even though it's pretty broken. That's a whole other subject. I could make a whole video ranting about that, but to sum it up, it's no MK9. MK9 is much, much better. But anyway, enough of that. So, I know a lot of you guys have been looking forward to seeing a lot of my, a lot more putty reviews, reviews in general, as opposed to just MK gameplay and stuff like that, and that's cool, I get it, you know, I mean, some of my best views are putty review vids, after all, uh, besides some of the voice vids as well, which I have something planned for that, you know, I have a whole list of new voices that I've been practicing for the past, like, year, so, uh, but yeah, stay tuned for that. I've also been flirting with the idea of uh, possibly starting an ASMR channel, and I know a lot of you guys have been supporting that idea. A lot of people have been telling me for like a few years now, you know, oh, do an ASMR, because I do have some ASMR videos on my current channel, which is MKF30. So if you're curious about that, just type in MKF30, ASMR, Putty, or an ASMR, MKF30, and, and you'll see them in the search bar. But anyway, without further ado, I believe I'm the first to review, hopefully, on YouTube this year, the 2019-2019 Crazy Aaron Thinking Putty Halloween Colors Exclusives. So, these came out a few days ago and I ordered them as soon as I saw them. Uh, they're three mini tins. I don't believe he's selling any big tins this year. Some years he does, some years he doesn't. But this, is a, uh, this isn't a three pack, just so you know, I had to order these individually at once. So, this year you have Mini Glow Thinking Putty Vampire. Okay. 13.13, uh, 13.3 grams. Two inch tin. That's the first one. Second one. Mini Glow Thinking Putty Monster. It's like a green putty. Also two inches. And last but not least, Mini Glow Thinking Putty Banshee. Also two inches. So, let's uh, open these up, test them, and give you my review here. All right. So I'm gonna let's see here. I will start with the vampire. Okay. So, vampire, as you can see, is red, blood red. It says nothing on the back, in case you're wondering. And these small two-inch tins always come with this little divider, which is very convenient. I kind of wish the larger ones came, because as you know, getting the larger putties out of the tin could be a bit of a pain in the butt. All right, so that came out pretty easily. All right. So, oh, I see some putty there. There we go. All right. That always bothers me. Whenever I see a little bit of putty on the tin, I just have to get it up, you know? All right, so let me just move this here. All right. <clears throat> so as you can see, it's a pretty soft putty. It's like, it's more or less the primary red color, but it's, uh, I would say maybe a little bit more red, a little bit lighter. Oh, what's going on? Oh, there we are. Okay, lost focus for a second. Softness to hardness rating, I would say it's about a, hmm, I would say about a three. It's not the softest, but it's not the hardest either. You know, once you start working it, it gets pretty soft really quickly in your hand. So, it's really just a plain red, a blood red. Okay. See how it is, uh, how it bounces. Okay. Molds pretty well. Bounces very well. Okay. It does have kind of somewhat of a, a shimmer to it. A little bit. Stretch as well. See how it tears. Tears smoothly. All right. See how it pops. So these are all glowing putties. Pops well. It's 
sculpts. See, vampire, so I don't know. I guess I'll sculpt my teeth, maybe? Yeah. Oh. Maybe I could just do a little, little, uh, quick little sculpt job here. Nothing too fancy, but yeah, sculpt some teeth. I like to try to sculpt whatever the theme is, you know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Teeth. <laughs> Alright, so sculpts well, bounces well, tears well, stretches well, pops well. Alright. Now let's see how it glows. Alright, so I'm just gonna take care of the lights here. have the my uh, UV light let's see how it glows in the light if it, could I, oh you could actually see a little see it see the little so if you use the UV light it's almost like a green it glows greenish so let's see how that glows in the dark okay so oh it's still glowing from the so it holds the charge pretty well. So it's normal color is red, and its glowy color is green, I guess. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, it's not the brightest color, the brightest glowing. Like, it's nowhere near the ectoplasm. But you can see it. You can definitely see it. So that's the uh, the vampire. Okay, go to turn on the lights again. Okay, there we go. So yeah, that's the that's the first one. That's the vampire, <laughs> two inch. So it doesn't glow very bright, but it's it's I like you know it's a cool red color if you like blood red. And, uh, you know, just a basic red cool putty. It's not bad, pretty cool. Okay, so that's the vampire. Next up we have... Monster. Alright. Get the plastic thingy out of the way. Okay. And this one is a pretty, almost like a translucent green. Yeah. Pretty cool. Uh, it reminds me of a similar color to green to the, uh, what putty is it? Uh, the Statue of Liberty putty. A little bit. This is more almost a mix between that and the zombie flesh green. It's kind of like a, I don't know, like an eerie green. Almost like a metallic green color, which I really like. It's pretty cool. Yeah. I noticed these you can't really do the transparent window very well, same with the red, I mean you can, but it's just it's not going to be as cool looking as say the uh, the super illusions or something. This one seems like a sh almost a metallic shimmery green, kind of like it, I like this one better than the red so far. Alright, so this one's also supposed to glow. Uh, this also feels a little bit softer than the red one, I would say about 2 out of 10. From softness to hardness, being, you know, one being the least and ten being the, the most firm. Alright, so let's bounce it. Okay, bounce as well. See how it tears now. It tears smoothly. And this one also has that uh, kind of like a dual color a little bit. Like when you tear it, or if you cut it, see, see, you kind of see the uh, the different color, the darker green going on there. Okay, 
see how it sculpts. So this is just monster, so I don't know. I'm just gonna sculpt a random monster here. Yeah, kinda looks like a little blobby monster. Yeah, yeah I don't know. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, see, you see the green streaks in it from the, the when you, whenever you cut it or tear it? I definitely like this one. The monster is my favorite so far for this year's Halloween putty colors. Okay, I'm gonna make a... Pops well. Okay, so let's see how it glows now. This one's gonna glow. Uh, let's see what the normal color is. Kind of like a darker green, I guess you could say. I don't know. Okay, shut off the lights. See how this one goes. Oh. So this one's also a green. Uh, like the red. This one I feel is a little bit brighter than the red. Yeah, definitely brighter than the red. The vampire. Ooh. Okay. So yeah, I mean that's uh so that is the monster buddy. Go for the yeah. This is definitely my favorite one. It's like almost like a metallic monster green color. All right, put that back in there. Right there. And last but not least, we have Banshee. Okay. So this is also a mini glow thinking buddy. Let's see how this one looks. Interesting color. Almost like a. A medicine color. You know, it may not be coming on out on camera too well, but it's like a very, very light whitish purple color. Okay, this one is definitely the hardest out of the three. For sure. This one feels more like a traditional, um, more traditional um, glowing color. You know, like the white ones. Although it does have a nice shimmer there. You can actually see it. Let's put it in the light for you. I don't know if you could tell, but it's kind of. Uh, that may be hard to see, actually, but it's almost, uh, there you go, you can see different colors in there if you look really closely, it's like almost like a green metallic color, yeah, I don't know, but it's pretty cool, it's not bad, but it's like a very, very light lavender purple-ish white color, yeah, and it's definitely firmer than the other two, so, this one, uh, hardness, uh, softness to hardness rating, I would rate this about a 4, I would say. Again, once you get it working in your hands, the warmth from your hands, it gets softer and easier to play with, more pliable, but it's definitely uh, firmer than the other two. So I would say this one's a, f a 4. This one, the Banshee's a 4. Oh. This one is about a, uh, about a 3, I would say, and this one's a 2. So they definitely have different textures in terms of like, you know, firmness and softness to firmness. Yeah, see, it's kind of like a, it's almost like, it's not quite white, it's like a purplish white, which is an interesting color. All right, so let's see how this one is. Oh, this one glows red. Okay, so we got some difference in glowing color here. Yeah, see? <laughs> Before I do the glowy test, let me just check out the... All right, this one's easily the best for the transparent window so far. Almost looks like spider webs. It's pretty cool. Yeah. See? All right. And stretches. See how it tears? It tears very smooth. No color contrast. One solid color. See how it pops. Well, see how it 
bounces. Bouncy, bouncy. The firmer body step will bounce way high. Definitely bounces very well. Okay. Sculpts. What is this? Banshee? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> screaming Banshee. I guess I'll do like a mouth screaming. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so let's test out the uh, the glowing, shall we? Put you right there. Charge right there. Shut off the lights. Three, two, one. Oh, wow, you see that red, man? It's like a comet. Wow, okay, this one by far glows the best out of the three. It's funny, oh wow, that's really bright. This may be one of the best glowing putties I've had. That's not green. Wow, yeah, this is really, uh, okay, so what I'm gonna do is, this, that's, wow, it's crazy. See, it's the light side, the glowing side, the dark side, light side, glow side, dark side, whatever. Okay, so I'm going to write something here. Yeah, KF30. I'm going to write another message. Subscribe. <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty much a, a really good putty if you want a, a good solid glow and dark putty. I would definitely glow. Uh, glow. <laughs> I would go with this one for the Halloween colors if you care for a glowing one. Besides ectoplasm, that's still my favorite for as far as like the Halloween colors and a glowing body. But this, you can't go wrong. Look at this, it's like so bright. Wow. Obviously the quick, the more you play with it, the quicker the glow effect will fade. Looks like a comet, you know. <laughs> Let me try bouncing it while it's glowing. So again, this one is, uh, which one is this called? Oh yeah, the Banshee. So yeah, the Banshee is pretty loud. <laughs> Banshee's a pretty loud color. Get it? Loud? <laughs> I know, bad joke. Okay, all right. So, uh, yeah. It's always cool when you can bounce a putty in the dark. So yeah, I'm gonna just put you there. Pretty cool. You can even see it in, in the normal light. If you look closely enough, you see. You see, see that? Yeah. I gotta say, this is pretty cool. The normal color isn't your traditional white glowing color. Like I said, it's like a, it's like an off white. It's like a, a very very light whitish purple, um, kind of a magenta lavender color, somewhat. So yeah, so that is the Banshee, that is the Monster, and that is the Vampire. All three are this year's 2019 Crazy Iron Thicket Putty Halloween Colors 2-inch Tins. You can get them now on PuttyWorld.com, probably Amazon too.
I, I imagine, since he, they tend to be available on there as well. Uh, I think it's pretty cheap. It's like 15 bucks in total. Uh, by the time you're done with shipping and handling. These are pretty cool. I mean, uh, my favorite would be, from a glowing point of view, definitely, this one definitely gets like a 10 out of 10. This one gets, uh, I would say like a, mm, maybe like a 7 out of 10. And this one I would say about a 5 out of 10. It doesn't really glow very well in my opinion. But as far as the glowing ratings, as far as the normal, regular color ratings, uh, I, my favorite is the monster because it's got, it's got this really cool, like, metallic green going on. Uh, it's definitely a unique color, so I would say like a 10 out of 10 for that one. And then the red, can't go wrong with red, I mean red's just classic Halloween blood, you know. But bats in the background there, uh, the vampire. So I would say this is about a, mm, I guess an 8 out of 10. And this is just like a, like I said, it's a, almost like a, a, a very, very light purplish white, which is unique. Uh, but I guess I'll go with a six, or may, maybe a, maybe a seven. I'll go with a seven actually, seven out of ten for the color. And uh, yeah, that would be you know my ratings of them. So I guess, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I will see you later. I know it's not Halloween yet, but it is October, so just wanted to get these out of the way. This is a 2019 Crazy Iron Thinking Putty Halloween Colors Vampire Monster Banshee, all glowing, glowing putties. Have a good one, guys. Later.